Hi, uh, Dick Rochford here. The Piper M600. November 855 Mike Alpha. Turn 10 degrees left. Vector to final approach course. Uh, 10 left. Uh, 5 Mike Alpha. Press, press, turn. Press, press. Compress. Good. Now you can activate that leg outside of Cusco. This is going to be an RNAV 23. We've been promised vectors to the final. So we're going to activate the leg outside the final approach fix. Like that. And now here's the airplane. Of course, we're going to fly the vector to the intercept and then activate the approach. Three questions and six steps. Which way? How low? What's next? Activate. We did. Flip. Flop. That's the flip the frequency and flop the VLOC. This is an RNAV, so we're not going to do that. Set. The course is set. It's an EHSI with auto slew. ID. That's done right here. And arm. That's this button right here when we hear the C word. Activate. Flip. Flop. Set. ID. And arm. This is the RNAV 23 Yankee, Providence, Rhode Island, Papa Victor Delta. When we're ready for the chart, we simply go to the chart page, and voila. We can now slew this one way or the other to see what it is we want to see. This will be geosynchronous when we get a little closer. So when we do, we'll come back to it. And for now, let's just stick with the map. Which way? How low? What's next? With these uh, GTCs, we can also assign different uh, information to the split screens. I like chart on the on the MFD when we get close enough. And then, till then, the map. So for weather or traffic or other things, we can take the dark blue banner for the number two GTC over to the number two PFD, and then we can select what we want. We can select weather, terrain, which terrain's a good one if you're uh, flying an approach in an unfamiliar area. We can also assign... Uh, uh, the procedure over there, we put the weather over there. The weather could be radar. To get to the radar with the GTC, you choose weather select, weather radar, radar settings, radar on. And there we have it. Now we can tilt this up or down. I'm going to tilt it up so we don't have so much ground clutter. Oh, sorry, wrong way. So this is a 10 degree beam width, and that refers to the uh, the main beam, 12.5 dB above. And uh, there you have it. So that's what we're looking at. If we want to get the uh, bearing pointer on, uh, we can do that. We we'll turn in here in a minute. So here on the GTC, we can choose bearing line, and we can put that bearing line with the slew knob over the part we want to look at, and switch the scan mode to vertical. And now the aircraft is over here, flying this way, and we're slicing through that area in front of us. Turns out that that area is symmetrical top to bottom. That means there's no water in that paint which means we're done with radar. We could turn it off if we wanted. We'll leave it in the horizontal Number mode. Eight, five, five, Mike Alpha. Turn left, heading zero, one, zero. Left, zero, one, zero. Five, Mike Alpha. 